bring that up over here. You know, in your relationships, it's the easiest for everyone to be the cruelest and the meanest to the people that love them the most. Because those people forgive them the easiest and they love them the most. But that makes them the worst people to be the cruelest and the meanest to. And what you find is a lot of times people will have situations in their life where they're upset, you know, they're going through some sort of drama and they want to lash out. They're angry and it's fair to want to vent. It's fair to want to lash out. It is. But make sure you do it to the right people. Don't do it to people who love you. Don't do that to them. Because all you're going to do is you're going to hurt them. You're going to make them feel bad. You know, um, and I see this a lot. This is a number one problem. This is a big problem. Not a number one problem, but it's a big problem in relationships. And women do this a lot. Women are really bad at this. Men do it too. But not to the degree that women do in the sense that women are consistently, they'll hold on to it for days because of the emotion and the feeling. It makes them feel better. And so they'll do it for days and days and days because it makes them feel better. Men, it's a spur in a moment type of thing. They lash out and then they calm down. They're like, oh, baby, I'm sorry, whatever else. But women, y'all start that whole, don't touch me. Oh. And the dude has nothing to do with whatever your problem is. You got a problem with your, your, your boss at the job, even though you shouldn't be working or whatever else. But whatever, it's a different conversation. Let me just reiterate the point of this very short video. Don't be cruel to the people who love you. Just because they'll forgive you the fastest, because they want to help you, they want to make you feel good, they'll chase after you, you know, they'll pursue you and, and you know, want to know what's wrong, want to help you, you know, do anything to, to reset the relationship to feel good about themselves because you have made them feel bad. That makes them the exact wrong person to be mad at. And one of the reasons why I, I'm very quick to shoot at people online, one of the reasons why I'm quick to shoot off at the mouth at people in real life, be ready to punch people in the mouth, is because I'm not gonna carry, this is my personal philosophy, guys, and maybe it'll work for you, maybe it won't. But my personal philosophy is the person who deserves to get shot, gets shot. I'm not carrying that to my wife. I'm not carrying that to my children. I'm not carrying that to my friends who you know are willing to forgive me and forget i'm not going to do that to them so when it seems like abu americans harsh online it's just you know what you you've elicited that response in me and i'm not carrying that luggage inside my heart to the people that i care for as opposed to maybe one of you strangers online who i'm just like who are you you know ahmed four seven seven zero six five one with no avatar or a cartoon avatar be cruel, be mean, be savage to the people who deserve it. But the people who love you the most, they don't deserve that. Don't do that to them. Dump that anger, dump that hatred, but not on people who care for you.